Hi, down in the dungeon, just an update on that uh, PC bench that I was uh, building. I have installed my light in now. Check it out. I've got my old, really old soft boxes. Well, oh, sorry. They're, yeah, they're mounted on a big uh, swing arm like this. Haven't cable managed yet, but there you go. I've got two of those soft boxes, so I can actually um, swing and uh, pivot these soft boxes um, anywhere. I want so that's pretty groovy and both of these have uh, three uh, UG LED uh, 5600k high CRI I think they're 98 CRI uh, LED so um, yeah really it lights up this um, bench very nicely but if you've been playing along at home you would have known that I got from the uh, dumpster this um there well a couple of these bench tops not sure what i'm going to do with that one might actually use it up in the lab anyway i've actually got a uh, workbench here now and uh, the, at the moment this uh bench top is not uh, secured on there but I, I just need to screw it down i'm going to have additional uh power points at the uh, back as well so that's going to be a very nice bench but um how do i light that one up well you probably saw it I've got a couple of old um, uh, Aperture Amaran, I think they're HR67 something. Um, yeah, 670 something. These are uh, 5600K as well, high CRI studio lights. But these are, unfortunately, um, unlike those, these are the ones I use in the uh, lab as my uh, main lights when I'm filming, but I use the C version, the 672, I think it is C. And that has a very wide beam angle, whereas this one is fixed color temperature, um, high CRI, but a very narrow angle. It's only like uh, 20 degrees or something like that. But anyway, I've mounted two of those. So I've got another one up here and I've got a remote control here. So I can just turn this on. Boom, like that. You can't see much difference, but yeah, you can see a bit of difference on the camera there, but it's much better than uh, it looks because the shoe phone, of course, is going to gain up. But uh, yeah, I can do that and I can uh, adjust the lower the brightness as well. I'm not sure if you're going to see that. Yeah, yeah, you might be able to. So yeah, that's that's really groovy. So I can just start switch those off and on as needed. So I can use this bench for uh, photography, um, any, uh, you know, extra projects, builds, things like that. Um, and I can shoot video down here. And just for that, I think I'm going to leave my old uh, Sony NX70 uh, uh, down here. Oh, we get a better mic solution because um, like Omnis and uh, shotguns aren't very good down here. You've got to use a lapel mic down in the dungeon here. But uh, yeah, I thought I'd just keep this down here and I can just shoot videos on a whim now with my new studio lights. Oh, groovy. So the angle on those isn't ideal. I'd prefer like a broader angle like you get with these uh, soft boxes here, like, you know, nice soft diffuse uh, light, but they work pretty well. High CRI, color matched, very happy with that. So there you go. There's the update for the dungeon. More to come.